Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Mikkel. Hope everyone is having a day of using discernment. I'm also having a day of using discernment. I appreciate all the love and support. And thanks you for tuning in with me for another video. But today's topic is something titled, it's going to be on, it's going to be about, it's going, it's going to be titled, to guys, target the individual community. We got to be careful about how we think that everyone is a gang stalker. And I'm going to be discussing some other reasons. Well, some people think us TIs and us targeted individual community are paranoid, delusional, and crazy. Because a lot of TIs think that everyone that cough is a gang stalker. Everyone that wrote their nose is a gang stalker. Everyone that clears their throat is a gang stalker. And it's not true. All because someone is coughing, that don't mean they is a gang stalker. They can have a cold. They might have a cold because if you got a cold, then you cough. You cough a lot when you're sick and have a cold. Or something could be in their throat. They could be trying to clear their throat. And everyone that's doing this, they're rubbing their nose. It's not a gang stalker. Their nose could be itching, or they could have allergies. They could have an allergy. That don't mean they is a gang stalker. Come, come on, come on. Us TIs, us targeted individuals, us that, us that are targeted. We got to use discernment and be wise. We got to. Use wisdom. Now, if someone constantly now, now you know, if someone is looking funny at you, if they're staring at you, and constantly watching at you, they giving you a devious, sneaky look, and they constantly coughing like, <laughs> if they constantly coughing like that. They constantly coughing that that person probably is a gang stalker. If someone normally sick and got a cold and doing this, <laughs> that's all they're doing. Or this, <laughs> they might do that. They might do that sometimes because they're sick and they got a cold that they're not no gang stalker. But someone constantly doing this, like I said, someone is constantly standing near you and behind you and be constantly watching you and they keep rubbing their nose like this, that that is a gang stalker. But someone not watching you, someone not standing near you, and someone not behind you and not watching you, not give you that evil eye, not looking funny at you, not give you no mean looks. And those strange looks, and they do this, then they nose might just itch. They may have an allergy. They might they might have allergies, but they're not a gang stalker. TIs. Everyone is not a gang stalker. Everyone is not out to get you. So be very careful about that. Don't become 
real delusional and real paranoid and that everyone is after you and everyone is out to get you and everyone that's in your surroundings and your atmosphere and come near you is a gang stalker. Everyone that's in your environment, everyone that you run into and see is gang stalking you. Don't think like that. You can't be that way because thinking and being like that, that's why some people think that us TIs are paranoid, delusional, and crazy. That's why some people think that us targeted individuals is imagining stuff. It's our imagination. Or we had some kind of nervous breakdown. Or we had some kind of mental breakdown. Because, we, because see, some people is going around saying that some people is going around saying and believing that us TIs went too far down the rabbit hole. We got caught up in the rabbit hole and that made us mentally ill, so paranoid, so delusional, and dysfunctional that we can't tell what's real from fake. We don't know where reality is. We're so much out of touch with reality all because we went far in that rabbit hole and got stuck in it and it messed and it messed us up. It messed up our psychological ability. It made it made us psychologically ill. That's why my videos that's why my videos on don't be afraid and scared to go down the rabbit hole. Okay. And don't overthink, overindulge, and and stress about the rabbit hole. That's why I made videos speaking and talking about that because I was saying don't overthink, overstress, over or overindulge in the rabbit hole. Just trust yourself. You know what's true to your soul and and your spirit. You know what's true. In your mind, body, heart, and your soul, your essence. You know what's true. That's why I say, don't get too stressed out about going down a rabbit hole. And don't get too caught in it and stuck in it. Because you know what's true. You know what's right. Just trust yourself. Trust your higher self. Trust your third eye. Trust your psychic abilities. And just keep living. Trust yourself and just keep living. Just keep living in the moment. Just keep living day by day. As life passes, you buy. And just hope for the future. Hope for the best in the future. That's all that we can do. That's all that can be done. But all of a sudden walking a dog, it don't mean they is a gang stalker. Now, if, if you see someone walking a dog once in a while or at times, then... They're probably not a gang stalker. They're just walking their dog. But every time you come out your house, you constantly and consistently see people walking the dog. Then they probably are gang stalkers. They probably is a gang stalker. And at times out of 10, they are gang stalking you. 
Let's see, got to use discernment and be wise and, and use wisdom, knowledge, and understanding and critical thinking abilities. Use your critical thinking skills and judge it as someone is a gang stalker and gang stalking you. Us TIs are targeted individuals. Us is targeted. Us, us the targets. We got to think and be this way. Yeah, because don't you know this gang stalking program? They play mind games on us TIs all the time. And they got directed energy weapons that can make someone cough. They can mess with someone's throat. They can make you itch and scratch your nose. And they can make you they can make you stutter and give you a lips. They can affect your speech. They can affect your cognitive ability. They can affect your brain. They can stop your thinking ability. They they can be they can make you get stuck and can't think and get your thoughts together and get your words out smoothly and clearly. They do all this. It's just TIs because if someone is saying that they're a targeted individual and all because they cough or scratch their nose. If you don't use discernment and wisdom, you may just assume to think they're not a targeted individual. They're fake T.I. And they really is a perp. They're a perp in disguise. They're a perp that's posing as a T.I. When, when that's not the case. They got weapons. They can make a real T.I. A real targeted individual cough. Or scratch their nose. It's to fool you. It's to throw you off course. And to fool you. It's to fool you that that real T.I. That real targeted individual. Is not a real targeted individual. Is not a real T.I. It's to fool you that they is a perp. When they're not a perp. And they really is a T.I. They really is a targeted. Individual. But you see. This game stalking program always play mind games. They always is playing mind games. Like I say, they got weapons that can make someone a Tourette's, give them a Tourette outburst that can make them stutter. The times they affect my speech. At times, this gang stalking program use weapons. They affect my voice. They affect my speech. At times, at times they make me cough. At times they make me itch and scratch my nose. At times they make me stutter and give me a lips. That's why. On some videos, I stutter a little bit, and and I have a lips a little bit, and and on some other videos, I stutter less, and my lips is less, or my stutter and lips is gone, is not there, and I speak better, I speak more smoothly, I speak more clearly. It's because they mess with. My voice and speech at times and make me cough or itch at times. And it's because they're trying to make me seem like I'm a fake T.I. They play mind games, but I'm not a fake T.I. I'm not a fake targeted individual. I'm a real T.I. I'm a real targeted individual. I'm the real deal. I'm as real as it gets. I'm going through hell right now. I'm still going through hell. I, I've not 
recovered and came up I've not recovered and came up out of hell yet I'm still going through hell I'm still in hell I'm still fighting for my life I'm still fighting for my survival my channel is suppressed the views on my channel are suppressed I'm shadow banned come on now I got 21,000 subscribers and my views is low like 10 13 sometimes 14 15 16 17 or 25 or 28 or 30 at times I reach views it's 50 or 40 some and once in a while I'll get some views as a hundred some once in a while it barely comes where if I get a video that's 300 some or 400 some I barely reach a thousand now I get more views back in the past but ever since they start targeting me hard and and I've been speaking out more about gang stalking and this gang stalking program the gang stalking list and their tactics ever since I've been speaking out more about it they've been suppressing my channel more the views of my channel has been suppressed and dropping more my views have been constantly dropping my views have been dropped more I'm shadow banned more now I'm blacklisted and blackballed on YouTube but since I came out talking more about and I suppose the gang stalking and targeting my YouTube channel is blackball and blacklisted ever, ever, ever since exposing this gang stalking program more I'm blackballed and blacklisted on YouTube even more now I got people you got people with smaller channels like with 200 subscribers or 300 subscribers 900 1,000, 2,000, and 3,000 subscribers but they get more views than me on the videos they get about 100 200 300 views so get 900 1,000 2,000 views 5,000 views I've seen channels with 1,000 subscribers 2,000 subscribers and 3,000 subscribers and they got views that's 5,000 7,000, 9,000, 10,000. I'm like, how is that possible? But I got more subscribers and getting less views. All, all what it's telling me is that it's the algorithm. The, algorith the algorithm is fixed. The YouTube corporation got the algorithm fixed. The game is rigged. The game is set a, a certain way. A lot of people sold out. So that's why the YouTube channel is pushed more. A lot of the numbers is fake and manipulated. All the ones that sold out, and so they sold, the channel is pushed more. The channel is pushed more and the algorithm and a lot of the numbers, the views, and subscribers, likes, comments is fake. A lot of the numbers is fake and manipulated. 
people better wake up and be wise. If you don't sell out and sell your soul, then the game is set against you. The game is rigged. The algorithm is rigged against you. Okay. I appreciate all the love and support. And thanks again for tuning in with me for another video. I'll see you all again in my next video. Enjoy the rest of your day of using discernment. I'm also going to enjoy the rest of my day of using discernment. Well, I'll tell the chosen ones, all the TIs, all the targeted individuals that's out there. I love you all. I sincerely, I sincerely and truly mean that from the bottom of my heart. Again, this is your girl, Mikhail the Woke Goddess, signing out. Until this time, I'll see you. One love, whole love, full love.